He wants to decorate the tree, so. This product is amazing. It's a marshmallow. Like, they look like little spaceships. <laughs> Hello, welcome to a vlogmas day five. It is Sunday. Um, so yesterday we didn't really do much, but um, I didn't film anything. I only filmed like this little snippet of what we made here, which I will go through in a minute because we're doing more. Billy's just gone out. He's not really feeling vlogmas this year, but so it'll just be me and maybe us. He wants to decorate the tree, so hopefully, I'm gonna set up a time lapse to do that because I want to see it. I enjoy watching us put up the tree and decorating it and stuff. Hello, the fine editing work of Photo Booth. So, after I filmed this clip, Billy got back from the shop where he was in this clip um, because he's he's camera shy. He doesn't really like being on camera, which I understand. But I always love watching our stuff back and. I was watching last year's or the year before the vlogmas back and it was just, I was enjoying seeing both of us together, what we were doing and so I, I've expressed that to him but I also understand that he doesn't, he wasn't brought up in this kind of world I suppose whereas I have always been filming videos, I've, ever since I was a kid I would use, I used to just film just random garbage <laughs> and think it was cool but yeah. I just wanted to say that after I filmed this, he got back and I told him that I'd filmed this clip saying that he doesn't really want to do it. And he actually got quite upset. He was just like, no, oh, no, I will. Okay, come on, let's do it. So just wanted to preface that, that he actually does. He probably doesn't want to be filmed like talking, but he said the time lapse would be good. So thought I'd add that in there. Enjoy the video. So hopefully that will go ahead. But I have been editing day three and four. So that it's a bit late, but it'll probably go out today. Um, but I did want to run through this. So this is our garland. After watching Zoe's vlogs, Zoe Suggs vlogs, Zoella, whatever, we see that she has a garland on her mantelpiece and we just love that. So we decided to get more wreaths because we had so much trouble finding a nice garland that we liked so we just literally cut two of them open and put them along here like that and also these are precious they spin and they sing and then this one follows like a magnet so it's like it looks like magic it's really cute So cute. And then this one. Oh, it's gonna spin on its own. Is it? Barely. But it just moves around like that and just sings a little song. And then you can obviously just switch them off. Yes, that is precious. And then because we have, oh, don't mind the mess. This is our new bed. We had getting it sorted today but there is a buffet over there and we were thinking of doing the same thing as here over there with maybe um some candlestick holders and some tall candlesticks so that's why we've bought four more i don't know why we bought four because it only takes two so we're going to use two for there and then i think billy wants to cut one open for the top of the bathroom cupboard which um, we've got like a gap between the cupboard and the ceiling so it's just gonna sit up above there I'm not sure if it's gonna work but we'll try and then one of them is gonna be for a centerpiece in our new table that's coming I don't know when but it's gonna be a centerpiece and then we're gonna have like a big thick fat like four um, wicked candle in the middle it's just gonna look really nice and yeah oh my gosh I'm out of breath it's 3 30 in the afternoon so we've been out all day buying stuff like that and just hanging out in the house sorting out the bed sorting out this getting rid of this bed 
and Billy doesn't want his advent calendar today so I opened it but he'll probably want it later because we had a massive lunch. Um, hope if today is the day to set up the tree I will obviously put it in the end of this clip but um, yes tomorrow is Monday so back to the usual um, job and I just wanted to point out these presents on the ground are for me. Billy has bought them and wrapped them for me. Um, so that's really cute. I really have no idea what he's bought me because I only asked for one thing. Oh, and also, I'm probably going to do this in another video, but they are cocoa bombs. I've always wanted to make one or even just try them. So I think that'll be a fun little video to do. Um, it includes silicon mold, marshmallows, and chocolate melting wafers. That should taste really good. It was only $12 from Target. But yeah, that's probably, this might be it for today, but I never say anything, but thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up. Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 6, I think. I have woken up with the biggest headache. I do not feel good. So I don't think I'll be working today. Not even from home. I can't hardly look at a computer screen. I'm trying to edit um, yesterday's video and upload that. And then I'm trying to edit day three because I didn't really do it day four. So day three is going up now. I'm editing yesterday's footage and then by the end of today I can add this on there. Oh my goodness. Yesterday I was saying we were trying to sort out the bed for, because this is the bed, this is our new bed and then our new mattress is in one of the other rooms. But I was saying we were trying to sort out this, um, this mattress. This bed is now gone. We slept on the couch. Billy slept on the small one, I slept on the big one because I'm spoiled. So let's do day six. I think it's right there. Surprise, surprise. I'll get my coffee actually. Um, um, where did I put it? Yeah, I don't feel well. I've got a mad headache. I was gonna, I was really motivated to do some working out today, but. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Um, yeah, I'm just going to upload this video. Upload, upload day three, edit day five, and then today is day six. So we'll see how we go. While I'm just about to shower, I thought I would show you this really cute bath mat that I bought from Best and Less. Um, it was only $12. Um... We usually have, these are just old towels, but we've got new towels that are in the spare room. We usually just have like a matching um, bath mat to the towels, but I thought this was really cute. I've always wanted like a fun little bath mat and I found one and I bought it. So I'm just about to have a shower now and hopefully feel a bit better. I also just want to point out that this product is amazing. Um, it's the Byron Body Coffee Body Scrub. I know everyone's different, everyone has cellulite, but if you're like me and you don't really like it because I have it on my butt and I hate it there, so I want to get rid of it. I know it's normal, but disclaimer, I don't like it, so I want to get rid of it. But this is amazing. Um, use it three times a week. I've only used it twice. Today will be my third day or the week, but technically it'll be like the first time for this week, if that makes sense, if I'm making any sense at all. But you just get a little handful and you scrub it on your body where your problem areas are. Um, for me, it's my butt and I just do it on my legs just because I don't really have that much cellulite on my legs anyway, but I just like it, so I do it anyway. Um, so you scrub it in circular motion and even after those two times of use, there has been a difference 
in my butt. Um, it's less cellulite -y. So I would highly recommend this. This, I found this in Australia in Chemist Warehouse. I'm not sure where else sells it, but I think it's about $8. Um, I would definitely, definitely keep using this one. It smells of orange and coffee. Like what, what could be better? It's just a little bit later. I've eaten breakfast, I've had my tablets and I've had some painkillers because this headache is still not going away. But I thought I would make the cocoa bombs. Um, I've never made them before. But I used to watch, um, I have saved some TikToks of them, like, but this was like ages ago. Alright, so we've got the melting wafers, the marshmallows, and the silicon mould. Let's see if there's instructions. Oh, it's on the side. This is a process. So let's start by melting the chocolate. Alright, I've zoomed you in so you can see. So these are just gonna melt a bit more. Okay, the bowl's a bit hot. That looks melted plenty. Now it says use the back of a, a basting brush or just the back of a spoon to line the moulds. So let's just give this a go. layer okay that's them in there frozen they look pretty good I reckon so I said to leave them on the bench for two minutes so while they try and get free of their molds it says get a pan and put it on low heat to melt half of the balls so that we can stick them together. So I've already cut open my marshmallows. Looks like they're going to come out pretty easily. Oh yeah. Okay. Something's gonna go terribly wrong. Yay, that's one. I feel like they're gonna melt with just my touch. Okay. This is a messy job. So it says put half of them with about six marshmallows. So two, four, five, six. Gosh. Six. And two, four, six. How cute. And then, I feel like it's just gonna melt with my fingers. So maybe if I just, Put them together like that. Oh my gosh, how does one do this? 
Like they're just melting. <laughs> I obviously did this way too thin around the edges. But that's okay. It's not going to focus, is it? There. So I'm just like using the heat of my hands just to seal it. Like they look like little spaceships. <laughs> I've just put them in the fridge for now because they are too high right now to fit in the shelf that I had them in. But I'll give it about 10 minutes. I need to wash all this chocolate off my hands because I'm going to get it somewhere. I'll give it 10 minutes. And then I'll make a, I'm going to make a mocha. No, should I? No. Yeah, I'll make a mocha um, with the hot chocolate bomb. And then I honestly just need to lie down because my head is pounding. I've taken Nurofen about half an hour ago and it's just, my head hurts. So I need to sleep. I need to close my eyes and do something. So see you in 10 minutes. Wow, let's use one of these fancy mugs. So I'm just gonna pop this little holy one in there like that. Hey, it's melting! Okay. So that is the chocolate and the coffee um, with the little marshy mellows on top. I think they would have melted in by now. Let's do a taste test and see if I used enough chocolate. With a marshmallow. Delicious. I think next time I'll use a paintbrush or, or uh, whatever you call it, one of those brushes, and um, I think I need to do a few more coats because I only did two because I'm impatient and I'm not well and I've got a mad headache. So it's pretty good though. Um, the chocolate flavor will be a lot stronger if I did like three maybe layers. Um, the marshmallows are perfect. Um, yeah, it melted really quickly. Um, I'm very happy with that. I think that's very festive and it's really fun watching the ball melt. But for now, I'm not sure if this will be my last clip of the fifth, of fifth, sixth, oh, but I'm gonna go heat up a heat pack drink my hot mocha and finish Outlander and log off work for the rest of the day because I'm just, I'm done. I can't do any more. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and I'll see you tomorrow or rather Wednesday for the two day uploads. Peace.